Like compared to a lot of other teams, we're pretty small, yeah. but we're all like, I think we're all really close and we all like really care about each other. We they're running for success. A local nonprofit is working to make track more fun while building bonds along the way. Oxymity's Matt Wickhouse takes a look at how they're providing kids in West Michigan a path forward. Tone Up Elite Track Club is giving kids a chance to have more fun with track. <laughs> and also a chance to run off some energy and be a mentor to other kids. Get them up, keep the toes pointing, keep those arms pumping. Tony Shellman is the head coach. Great job, lean forward, good, good. And founder of Tone Up Elite Track Club. It started, it started because I get tired of the stigmatization of track is not fun here. When he started it back in 2018, the goal was to give kids a chance to have fun with track. To see it grow, get bigger and bigger, it's just making me feel like I'm doing something doing something right. Dozens ranging from 8 to 18 years old here at Hausman Field in Grand Rapids. These parents know where they're at. They're getting some good opportunities. They can mingle with some people that they want to use to mingle with. They're not only mingling, but many of the older kids are mentors to the younger ones. A lot of these kids don't have uh, younger siblings, so it gives them a chance to be a big brother, a big sister sometimes. So it always feels good to see that giving back. I good job. Keep it tight to the body. It's okay. Taylor Pierce James, one of the many who's grown with the program. It makes a huge effort in trying to like prevent youth violence and like try to heal from that. Taylor is more than a track runner. She's a mentor here. When you had those mentors yourself, like some of the older kids that have already graduated now and are on to like college and stuff, like it's really easy to step into their positions and just kind of like take the younger kids under your wing. Like all the way, all the way. Shellman adds having those younger allies can be a game changer when talking to kids. The older kids can get across to them quicker than I can, you know, because it's a peer. Shellman says he has 22 athletes who have qualified for the AAU Junior Olympics. He says, unfortunately, there are some who won't be able to go because of financial burdens. So if you'd like to donate, head to this article on fox17online.com. In Grand Rapids, I'm Matt Woodcoast, Fox 17 News. As we continue our Path Forward series, building community relationships and discussing crime reduction, if you know of a group or organization we should connect with, please email us or head to our website by scanning the QR code right there on your screen.